Everyone in the rap game hates each other right now. Kendrick is calling out the big three. Future and Drake are beefing. And everyone's unfollowing Drizzy. So how the hell did we get to this point? Well, Drake and Kendrick have actually had a long-standing rivalry. If y'all want me to make a detailed video about that, I got y'all, bro. But fast forward a couple years, Drake drops his album for all the dogs. And he has J. Cole collaborate on a track called First Person Shooter. J. Cole actually mentions K-Dot saying, Love when they argue the hardest MC. Is it K-Dot? That is it all for your me. We the big three like we started a lead. But right now I feel like Muhammad Ali. Jermaine, you got the best rhyming in the game, bro. I ain't gonna hold you. J. Cole's basically saying him, Drake, and K Dot are all in a different league compared to everyone else, bro. The big three, all right? Well, Drake and J. Cole are actually not chill with Kendrick, as I aforementioned. And they had multiple different sneak disses towards him throughout the song. So obviously, y'all know Kendrick, a quiet ass nigga. He did not say anything about this shit. Fast forward a couple months. Metro and Future dropped their collaboration album, and Kendrick happens to be on the song like that. And on that track, he calls out Drake and J. Cole. In his verse, he was talking about how they would sneak this in, throwing some subliminals towards his way. He was not rocking with it at all. And he said, fuck the big three, it's just big me. Fuck you, Drake. Fuck you, J. Cole. I'm the only nigga in the rap game that's above everyone else. And y'all are probably like, okay, why would Metro and Future just allow Kendrick to diss Aubrey? Well, them niggas don't like him either. Basically, Metro had this tweet where he said, Her Law still keeps winning rap album of the year over heroes and villains. Proof that award shows are just politics and not for me. I don't care about awards, honestly. The true award and reward is knowing that the music I spend so much time on brings joy to people's everyday lives. So this was a while uh, back. I think it was during the Grammy, some shit like that. So Drake obviously did not like that comment from Metro. Now y'all are probably wondering, where the fuck does Future come into this? Isn't Future like Drake's best friend? I thought they was too until he randomly started this. I don't know why they beefing. I don't know why they don't like each other. Uh, apparently niggas are saying it's over a female. Honestly, if you finna hate on your friend over a female, you lame as hell, my nigga. I'm sorry, but you fucking lame. Metro Boomin actually said it's not over a female and those are apparently just rumors. So I'm not even gonna talk about it until there's more confirmation or some shit so i'm not gonna waste my time on that a fan on twitter actually asked metro are you and drake seriously beefing or is it not that deep and metro did say it's not that deep at all all i know is that drake and jermaine better clap back because y'all are not just finna take disrespect like that <laughs> everyone is kind of switching up on aubrey now niggas like nav who's another toronto nigga he unfollowed drake and he started talking his shit well drake he didn't like that nav unfollowed followed him so he made a post using one of his lyrics on some shit i don't know the corny drake typical shit that he does i don't even know and somehow that nigga john moran is tangled into the situation he reposted a tweet of metro booming saying stay on that side when they switched up you switched up stay on that side man I don't even know why this nigga is, is trying to associate himself with this shit. Focus on not getting suspended again, my nigga. Why are you talking about these rich niggas' beefs, bruh? Focus on your own shit. You got nothing to do with this. I really got much else to say. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you guys subscribe. If y'all fuck with 2K videos, I put Michael Jordan and his sons all on the same team. Y'all can see if they win a championship or not. That being said, it's like 1 a.m. Uh, I'm trying to grow my YouTube more. I love you guys. Let's get to 900 subscribers. Peace.